Square Enix. Caviar. Love me. I want you to love me. Square Enix. <laughs> Lost lives. The fire that tears lovers apart. The flames of war are ablaze once again. I repeat, unleash your powers for the glory of the Knights of the Seal. I'm asking you to let me die. My beauty, it is my sin. Damn, I'm hungry. Ugh, what was that? That didn't even touch me. I understand now. This is my destiny. You're kind and gentle, yet somewhat wild. That's why I... I wish I could be a savior. I'm glad I met you. Goodbye, Noe. I want to save you. See me grow wings and fly high. The old seals destroyed, the world will end. Or maybe it's a new beginning. It doesn't matter. We're going in. You. The world would be better off without weaklings like you. It's all wrong. Everything. Let Mana go. Please, don't hate me. You saw the truth yourself. Is it over, Kaijin? This will be our final battle. Let's go, Noe. Before I was born, a war broke out between the Empire and the Union. Many people bled, and the world marched towards destruction. Lost lives. Sacrifices. The all-consuming blaze. The world saved. Kaim, the soldier who lost his voice. Angelus, the Red Dragon. They were the events of 18 years ago. Five seals hold in place the Red Dragon. The last bastion against world destruction. Charged with protection are the Knights of the Sea. In charge of each sea is a guardian, a lieutenant among the knights. Now, a young warrior has been accepted into the Knights of the Sea. A young man raised by a blue dragon. His name is Noah.
Well now, it's your time at last. Good luck in the royal duel. Eris, what's the point of the royal jewels anyway? Why waste time fighting with our allies? No way. You really don't know a thing, do you? We Knights of the Seal are here for one thing only. And that is to protect the Goddess Seal. The Royal Jewel is held so that the Lieutenants can assess the progress of their Knight's training. It's very important. You've only just joined, but you're a real Knight now. You make sure you don't embarrass yourself out there. Do you hear me? Yet I always do. No way. This battle is important. Why don't I run you through the practice course one more time, just for old time's sake? Why not? It's been a long time. I better see if I can remember how.
Looks like you're warmed up now. Next. Hey, wait. What do you want? Haha. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing from you, Eris. No. My quarrel is with your friend there. First, our former general plucks Dragon Child here out of the wilderness, then the Hierarch calls him a savior. This boy gets on my nerves. That is enough! No, eh? You're entered in the royal duel, aren't you? How about some real training, eh? Eh? You can't call your dragon friend in here. I'm in charge of his training, soldier. It's okay, Eris. Come on, then. If it's a fight you want. That'll be enough for today. It looks like you boys need to spend a bit more time on training and a bit less on picking fights. Now get out of my sight. It's almost time. General Gizmo will be waiting for you. Try to stay relaxed, and good luck. <laughs> I'll be fine. Are you going to treat me like a kid forever? <laughs> I'll go on ahead of you. I'll be watching your fight along with the other officers. Yeah. Thanks, Eris.
The one that everyone heralds as the savior. I don't think these knights are a match for you. General Gizmo, you are to be my opponent. I am on it. Are you ready, Noe? The priests are watching. Try not to embarrass yourself. Harris, give the signal. Sir. Now, Dragon Boy, let's see if that reptile raised you well. Show me how strong you have become. Begin! The only way for a weakling like you to win is to fight in large numbers. 